Today we're going to talk about London and London prices and what you can do with the money that you invest in London compared to the money you can invest in other parts of the UK. Welcome back to the YouTube channel Stepping Bricks. Now my name is Dr. Giuseppe Paladini. I'm the founder of Stepping Bricks and I'm here to teach you about property investment. Let's say you have 700,000 pounds in the bank and you want to invest it in a property in London because you feel that London is the best place to invest in the UK and you feel you're not going to rent it out if you invest in property in some other parts of the UK. Now, this might sound like crazy what I'm saying but in reality this is exactly what some people told me when they called me and they said I want to invest in London because if I don't invest in London where else and I'm not going to get any tenants. I was like what are you talking about? The UK is full of houses and full of people they can buy and they can rent so you have both options 50% of people buy 50% of people rent so it's really important that you understand this proportion because that means wherever there is a renter there is property investment so there is a landlord so we established now the baseline that you can rent properties everywhere in the UK and in the world I would say let's say you live in London you love London and you want to invest in a property in central London let's say a studio apartment or a one bed for 700,000 pounds you get this apartment and you rent it out more or less for about two three thousand pounds a month right now if you were to buy somewhere else in the UK what you can get is a much higher ROI return on investment you leverage your money to split it into a lot more deposits with 700,000 pounds you can buy up to 28 houses you put 25% deposit the bank will give you 75% loan to value so the rest and you can buy a property each property can be rented anything between 500 700 500 pounds per month times 28 properties the minimum of 14,000 pounds per month times 12 per year you will have 168,000 pounds okay but if you rent it for 700 depends on the area depends on the property 700 pounds per month times 28 that's the the income per month times 12 man 235,000 pound per year that's what you can get if you invest smartly and not just throw your money in any London property just because it's London okay now don't get me wrong I love London if you want to invest in London if you have the resources to invest in London feel free to do it but for the sake of 1300 pound per month compared to the figures that I just show you it it would be nuts not to do it if your plan is to build your portfolio, your property portfolio and to grow and to retire or to live the life at your own terms. Again, it's all about choices, it's all about business plan. You need to make a business plan. This is exactly what we give to our academy members. We give them a business plan so they can plan accordingly and they can follow the steps to reach their financial goal and you are not going to make mistakes because you are supported by the community. Right, so I hope you enjoyed this other video. This is about London versus the rest of the world. If you want to know more about property investing, if you want to know more about mindset and business and mentoring, I'm here for you. Comment below, let me know your opinion because I'm very curious and I'll reply back personally. Subscribe if you haven't yet and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye from the south of Italy.